Hey art friends, in this lesson I'm going to show you how to draw a funny dragon fruit. I hope you're going to follow along with me. You need your drawing supplies. Let's get started. I'm using a pencil first to draw with so that we can get our guidelines and the shape of our dragon fruit just the way that we want it. Then we're going to use a marker. I'm also using marker paper to draw on. All right, let's start by drawing a raindrop shape and we're going to draw it pretty big to fill up our paper. So I'm going to start here at the top and I'm going to draw an S curve that comes down around and then we're gonna come back up and connect at the top. So we have this really cool raindrop shape. And that's all we need our pencil for. Let's switch to our marker. Sometimes we add a funny face at the end, but let's add it right now so that we have room for all of the spikes on our dragon fruit. And also because it's just me in the studio, I might go too fast. So remember, if you need extra time, you can always pause the video. Let's draw a really big mouth. I'm gonna draw a really big smile and then I'm going to draw it coming down and oh, let's, let's connect on the other side. There we go. And let's draw the teeth. I'm going to draw another curve inside for the top teeth. And we could also draw a curve for the bottom teeth. Oh, let's also draw little lines for the teeth inside. There we go. And then also on the bottom. We could also add a tongue. I'm going to draw it coming out like this, curving around and then connecting back down. Oh, and let's color in this shape on the left and also on the right. This will make the mouth look darker and more 3D. But you guys can change your funny faces. You don't have to draw it just like me. Oh, let's also add eyes. I'm going to draw a circle over here and a circle <laughs> over here. Here, we're going to draw the highlight next a little circle in the top left. This makes our eyes look shiny. And we can also color in the big circle, but leave that little circle white. Now it just looks like a funny raindrop. Let's turn it into a dragon fruit. And they have these really cool spikes coming out of them. But let's start here. I'm gonna draw a spike that comes out of the pencil line or the shape of our dragon fruit. And then we're gonna come back in. And this is one of the reasons why we use the pencil so that we could get these spikes coming in and out of our shape. Let's add another one over here. We'll come out and then we'll come back in. And I'm also going to add one maybe right here next to the eye too. Oh, and let's add one here. And I'm going to add another one over here too. <laughs> Looks like our raindrop is on fire. We're going <laughs> to let's add spikes on the inside now. I'm going to add one on the left and one up a little higher on the right side. And let's also add, well, let's add one close to the top. I'm gonna draw it coming down. On this side, let's draw the other spike coming out really far and then back in. This is looking really cool. Now let's switch back to our pencil or the eraser and we're gonna erase the guidelines that are inside of the spikes. So I'll start here at the top and we're just erasing this part of the pencil line. We want to keep the rest. We'll erase inside of these spikes all the way down and finish on the left side. Now let's switch back to our marker and we're going to trace over the pencil guidelines. So we'll start at the top. We'll draw the top of our dragon fruit and then we'll connect these spikes into the spike next to it. Start here, and then let's do the same thing on the other side. Just trace over the pencil lines and the bottom. And we did it. We finished drawing our dragon fruit. Now we're ready to color it. This part will speed up, so remember to pause the video at the end to match my same coloring. And we did it. We finished drawing our dragon fruit. It looks super cool, all colored in. I hope you guys take time to color in your drawings also. You can even add a background or even more dragon fruit. Maybe there's some jumping in the air. That would be awesome and would complete your drawing. I hope you had a lot of fun following along with me and drawing a funny dragon fruit. Remember, it's okay if your drawings look different than mine. I'm sure they turned out awesome. The most important thing is to have fun and practice. And we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye.